So this is just a quick little hack that I wanted to mention at the end of my last video, but then we lost power and then I took my pants off and decided I was too lazy to actually, you know, set up the whole recording thing again. So I'm just going to do it right now really quickly just as its own little upload, uh, but do know that this is meant to go hand in hand with the medical marijuana thing. However, that being said, this hack can also work for people who may live with or spend a lot of time around just regular smokers as well. Um, I myself am extremely sensitive to smoke and vapor, uh, so much so that it makes me sick. Uh, it used to, you know, just be gross to me, but now with the breathing issues that I have and, you know, my need for oxygen, it's a lot more severe. So this is something that's really come in handy. This can be done with a toilet paper roll. It doesn't have to be too long, but I think longer is a little easier. Um, Open-ended on both ends, and basically you just need some dryer sheets and a hair elastic. Um, so first things first is you just wrap as tightly as you can, wrap a dryer sheet around the edge here and secure it with a hair elastic, and then just jam a crap ton, and I mean a crap ton, of dryer sheets on the inside. Um, and then whenever you're done, whenever you're ready to exhale or your friend or whoever, you know, is going to be using this, whatever you're making it for, is ready to exhale, you just blow through here. And it looks kind of weird, it sounds kind of weird, but I swear to God it works. Like, you cannot smell a thing with this. This is what I do um, on the days where I'm not using edibles and stuff, um, or the capsules, and I need to go to work, and I need to be discreet. This is the only way that I can trust that I'm not going to go into public reeking of pot. Um, so, yes, uh, if you guys didn't know about this, very cheap, very easy to make. I don't know exactly how much, but I would estimate probably about five bucks. Um, I bought a little PVC kit that had a few extra pieces that I need because it was the best I could find at the time, but I'm sure if you go to Home Depot or something, you can probably get just get like an individual piece cut just for your needs right then and there, much cheaper. Um, so I would estimate only a few dollars, uh, probably no more than five. Very easy, just dryer sheets. Um, this part, I've actually, the top one, I've never replaced, but every month or so, just pull them out and jam some new ones in there and yeah there you go uh the perfect desmellifier um yep that's about it stay in school and don't do drugs so one last thing it's 12 51 according to my computer i really need to go to bed i just wanted to let you guys know that i've been working my butt off all night to recover those corrupted files from that vlog that I tried to film. I have been working on it literally since I woke up in the morning straight up until dinner. You have no idea how mad I am that I lost that. That's never happened before. Like I I know how to recover technical shit on my computer. Like ah oh god, I'm so mad. Anyway, I just wanted to let you guys know that I am going to re- film everything and redo all of that as soon as I'm able to, but it's probably going to take a few days until I can actually do that because it's, it was a lot of work that I lost. Um, so basically just keep that in mind and it was an educational vlog all about medical marijuana. Um, so yeah. <laughs> If none of this makes sense, that's why, because um, I finished and basically we had a huge thunderstorm and lost power and I don't know what happened, but I lost everything. And I mean everything. So I'm going to go to bed now because I'm exhausted <laughs> and I really don't even want to think about doing it all over again. Oh man.